Believe it or not, Goofy is one of Disney Dreamlight Valley's most important characters that'll help you make a ton of money through buying and selling. He's also the key to unlocking additional characters within the game. Let's take a look at all of Goofy's quests and detail everything you need to know about them. Welcome back everyone, it's Abdallah here with another awesome Disney Dreamlight Valley Tips and Tricks tutorial video. Today's video is all about Goofy and how to finish all of his 7 quests within the game. I'll be showing you exactly how many materials you'll need, how to complete each quest, and what you'll unlock from finishing Goofy's final level 10 quest. As always, thank you so much for all the support on the Disney Dreamlight Valley videos that I've been making. If you haven't already taken a look at the playlist, go check out some tips and tricks videos as well as some more quest tutorials. The first thing that we'll need to know about Goofy's quest is exactly how many materials you're going to need in order to finish every single one of them. From his first quest to his level 10 quest, you'll need the following. 3 basil, 3 oregano, 30 hardwood, 7 rope made out of exactly 56 fiber or 12 seaweed, 25 clay, 10 iron ingots made out of 50 iron ore and 10 coal, 2 freshly caught shrimp, two clams, two scallops, two tomatoes, and three random veggies. Another thing that you'll need to know is that by finishing off Goofy's quest, you'll unlock Ariel, another villager within Disney Dreamlight Valley, who sequentially helps unlock a ton more quests. If you don't have a certain quest unlocked, take a look at the quest screen and read the prerequisites. Odds are is that you'll need to boost a certain villager's friendship level or unlock other villagers to continue. Alright, starting off, the very first quest of Goofy's is very early game. You've probably already done this, but if you haven't, we're going to cover all bases. Uh, it's one of the earliest quests, and it'll introduce you to fishing as well, as learning how to use Goofy's stalls to buy and sell different items. After retrieving Goofy's fishing rod, talk to him again and ask him, how do I fish? He'll then have you fish for anything, including a lump of seaweed. Show him what you caught, and he'll lead you to his stall. Speak to him when you get there, and he'll ask you to use Scrooge's sign to fix the stall up. Scrooge McDuck shows up and allows you to fix the entire thing for free. Once the stall is fixed, talk to Goofy again to conclude the quest. Goofy's second quest is called A Warm Welcome. Talk to Goofy and he'll task you with cooking something for him. You'll need to find three basil, which is found on the ground in the plaza, and three oregano, found on the ground within the meadow. Head to the nearest stove and cook any recipe that includes either basil or oregano. You can easily whip up something called tasty veggies by cooking any veggie with any spice and that will count. Speak to Goofy to finish the quest. Goofy's third quest is called Photographic Memory, and Goofy wants you to help fill his scrapbook with pictures of various things in the valley, so talk to him to get the quest started. He'll have you snap pictures of all sorts of greenery around the valley, so simply take out your camera, ensure the subject is in the frame, and then snap the picture. If you have the quest tracked, you'll then see the text gray out, meaning that it worked. You'll be taking pictures of the following, an apple tree found within the plaza, a raspberry bush found within the plaza or the meadow, and a banana tree found on Dazzle Beach. When those three pictures are taken, he'll want you to take a picture of the squirrels in the plaza and the rabbits in the meadow, both of which are very easy to approach. If you're having a hard time with the rabbits, chase them around the bit and they'll eventually stop. Goofy will then want you to take pictures of specific flowers. Case in point, the red daisy and the green rising penstemon. Both are found within the meadow. And the white and pink falling penstemon and dandelion. Both found within the plaza. After taking pictures of those, head back to Goofy to finish the quest. Goofy's fourth quest is the Mysterious Wreck. Once you have access to Dazzle Beach, head on to a small island right offshore and investigate the paddle in the sand. After you pick it up, you'll then be able to speak to Goofy about it and offer to fix the shipwrecked raft. In order to fix the raft, you'll need a lot of ingredients, so this may take you a little bit. 
the 30 hardwood, which is going to be found on the floor next to trees everywhere except for the beach, the plaza, and the meadow. You'll need 7 rope originating from 12 seaweed crafted into the fiber needed to craft the rope. 25 clay, which can be dug up from the ground with your shovel in the Glade of Trust, Sunlit Plateau, or the Forgotten Lands. And you'll also need 10 iron ingots made with 50 iron ore and 10 coal. Head over to your crafting station and craft the raft repair kit, then speak to Goofy to lead him down to the beach. Once you're there, interact with the raft to use the repair kit on it, and then talk to Goofy to finish the quest. Doing so will allow you to ride that raft and begin the Lonely Island quest in order to unlock Ariel in your valley. Goofy's fifth quest is called Dinner with a Friend. It's time to cook a seafood meal with Goofy, so talk to him to start the quest. Mickey's coming over for dinner, so you'll need to catch some seafood items. Two shrimps found in the fishing spots on Dazzle Beach, two clams and two scallops found on the sand in Dazzle Beach. Return to Goofy with those ingredients and he'll give you the recipe for Booyah Bays. Since you'll be cooking two of them, the only other ingredients you'll need are two tomatoes and any other two veggies. Put the shrimp, clam, scallop, tomato, and any other veggie into a pot and cook the Booyah Bays twice. Give them both to Goofy to complete the quest. Goofy's sixth quest is Photo Fervor. You're continuing Goofy's scrapbook with this quest, so talk to him in order to get it started. Goofy wants you to take a picture of the Swamp's Giant Willow Tree, which is smack dab in the middle of the Glade of Trust. Next, he'll want you to take a picture of Sunlit Plateau's Elephant Graveyard. You'll then take a picture of Scrooge's store in the plaza, along with Remy's restaurant and the Dream Castle. If you played far enough in other quests, you'll then have access to all the various pillars in each biome for the next set of pictures. Head to the Peaceful Meadow to snap a picture of the Pillar of Friendship. Head to Dazzle Beach for a picture of the Pillar of Power. You'll then find the Pillar of Courage in the Forest of Valor. Then finally, to the Glade of Trust for a picture with the Pillar of Trust. Talk to Goofy for one last time and he'll ask to take a picture with you. So equip any hat from your inventory and snap a selfie with Goofy to complete the quest. Goofy's last quest is called Scrapbook Blitz. This is his final level 10 quest and it's going to require you to finish the scrapbook that you started by taking pictures of various villagers, starting with a picture of Mickey and Donald. After that, you'll be tasked with taking pictures of any other four villagers that you want. Once you're done with that, speak to Goofy and he'll give you the scrapbook item to place down somewhere in your village. After placing it, a bunch of villagers will gather around the scrapbook for one last photo and after that's finished, chat with Goofy to receive his signature hat as a reward for finishing all of his quest lines. And there you have it, all seven of Goofy's quests within the game. If you're curious as to how each of the quests look like with full dialogue, take a look at the Disney Dreamlight Valley 100% walkthrough playlist. I'll be working on full character guides for the rest of the villagers in the game, so stay tuned. And if this video helped you out, be sure to do me a favor and share it with some other friends that also enjoy playing. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.